Welcome to The Snap. This is the segment where we answer frequently asked questions in a very rapid fire format. So let's get right into it. On this week's episode of The Snap, we are gonna be performing some experiments to demonstrate how a torch can change your experience. I'm gonna be assisted by Will. Hello, you may recognize me from the tent. And Will is gonna be heating three different 2020 M's. It will be heated with a different torch each and every time, and I will not be aware of which one is being used. I'm blind! At the end, I will give my guesses. Ooh. And we'll see what happens. You were wrong. Let's get started. Yeah, this, ooh, it's smooth, but yeah, I, th I have a hypothesis. I'm gonna take some mental notes, see if I'm right. So that was number one. That one, I feel like the vapor was denser. So that's helpful. That gives me some ideas. This one was the toughest one, I think, to gauge, but that's also helpful information. So I'm gonna kind of give my hypotheses blindfolded. I think the first one was a double. The second was a single. The last one was the triple. You were wrong. You were correct in the middle, but the first one was actually the uh, triple torch. Interesting. Torch. And the last one was the double torch. Now, when you heated the double torch, what way did you have the flame? Was it perpendicular or was it across to pinpoint? The heating technique that I used was just right at the bottom of the cap, um, away from the flame, using a triple torch. The double and the triple were very, very close. But with the double, when you're heating, was it like this or was it like that? With the double, it was more like this. Okay, and so that's gonna provide a very similar experience to a triple torch, and that shows too uh, how technique can change your experience with the torch. But like with a single, if you're looking for clouds, it's definitely going to be the easiest way. When I drew from that one, it was almost immediate that uh, I could tell the density. And you can get that experience depending on what the double torch, the which way it's oriented. But you know, the double and the triple, depending on your t technique, they're very, very, very similar. It just felt like the Double torch was a little bit more mild. This one was the toughest one, I think. It wasn't quite as dense, but still was very tasty. I think that was quite interesting. I would love to see, maybe this is something that we can do on a reel at a later date, but I'd love to see if you'd be able to potentially, by changing the technique, make me believe that a triple or double torch performs as well as a single from a cold start. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, you'd be able to as well, just by changing the technique. Yep, and so look for that at a later date. I think that'll be quite interesting and kind of show you a little bit of that flexibility. Let us know if you're able to do an A-B comparison yourself and tell the difference at home. Let us know in the comments and we'd love to hear it from you. We'll see you next time. And that has been The Snap. Once again, I'm Retail Josh and thanks for watching.